you know when you take a photo sometimes and you just look at it and you think, what the hell is that? Very exciting day today. Special package coming. So I better get up and get ready. Because the postman does not want to see this. <laughs>
feels really tactile and, and solid. The, like the rubber grips and all the knobs. <laughs> knobs. It just feels really. I can't think of the word. I believe one of these legs comes off to act as a monopod. So you can take that one off. Stick. Uh, down there. Monopod. The quality of the craftsmanship on this is just insane. Such a solid bit of kit. Man's covered in dog hairs now, but that's not their fault. And it seems like it's going to be pretty. Um, what's the word? Let's but sack all that. Let's just go and try it out. I'm on East Bank Road in Sheffield. Big steep hill, like one of the main roads in the city. Get a pretty decent view down towards the city centre. So, let's see if we can get a cool, uh, cool shot. And we'll test out this little bad boy. All down the side of this road here, we've got these really nice um, sort of cherry blossom trees, but with a long exposure, I think because it's a breeze and they're not going to be moving too much in a long exposure I don't think it's going to work too well there just coming out the way from the trees a bit further down the view just opens up and we can see the whole of the city centre set up and see what we got first thing that I notice like straight away just setting the tripod up it's just so easy just so easy to use it's, it's fluid everything's just really smooth and then once the camera's in everything's locked in place it just feels really really sturdy and solid now something that I've noticed straight away comparing it to like you know, other tripods. I don't have a, an L bracket, so if I want to switch from horizontal to a landscape to portrait, horizontal to vertical, pretty quick, it's as simple as this. And it does actually go all the way over to the full vertical position. Because some, not all tripods actually do that. It looks as if you can get it there, but it won't go all the way over. You've got to adjust the legs on your tripod to change angle. Right, so I've only been using this tripod for what, 10 15 minutes so far, and it's I'm in love with it, it's awesome. It's so easy to use, intuitive, smooth, and solid and sturdy at the same time. It's fantastic. So well designed and well engineered. I think this is a word I'm going to keep coming back to with this. It is, it's solid. It's not the lightest tripod that I've ever carried, but to me, that, that's a good thing. You know, I've got I've got travel tripods that weigh nothing and they're kind of practically useless. There's no there's no flex in the legs at full length. It just feels sturdy and solid, like you can actually do the job. Uh, right, which way am I going here? I'm not exactly testing this now in harsh conditions tonight, but that's just uh, the nature of how it is, I suppose. I'm sure over the coming weeks and months. This thing will get an absolute hammering. I'm predicting that it'll hold up. See this point in the night, not every time, but a lot of the time, just as I'm heading out, I start panicking a bit, like I'm gonna miss something. I don't know why. I don't really know where that comes from. It's not like anything's going anywhere. I'm not quite sure what I made of that location. I mentioned in my last video the, about the scene not always translating well into a photo. I don't want to start using that as an excuse. But I'm not convinced that that scene back there translated well. I don't know. Anyway, I'm, uh, I'm heading into the city centre now. See where I can find. You know when you take a photo sometimes and you just look at it and you think, what the hell is that?
whilst I am enjoying trying uh, me Travis out and it's all good uh, and it's in no way the fault of the tripod but all my pictures are crap tonight it's not working Such a quality feel to the to the tripod. As you're carrying around, you can just tell it's just a. I don't keep using the word. It's solid. It's, it's just a really good solid piece of kit. But another thing about the um, the airhead Neo is it's quite versatile. Um, it's only just took me a a little while to realise I can spin it round, flip the camera into portrait on the other side so now I can actually get the shot I was after Yeah, 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 guy, guy let me in there. Yeah, so. and I seen you playing. <laughs> <laughs>
usable, practical. So, recommendation, buy one. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button if you've liked, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more of this kind of stuff. Uh, leave a comment if, uh, if you want to. No, leave a comment if you've also got a three-legged thing, Punks, Travis, and all that kind of stuff. I'll see you in the next video. Even out shooting you. Hey. Oh, yeah, yeah. Nice one. Oh, here Good. we go. I'm going to do one before we go. One. Uh, big one. Go on. Oh, think of me in the park and the slippers.